Why is the Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 2 only available inside the Poco F5 and not any other phone? Especially considering the 7 Plus Gen 2 is based on TSMC's 4 nanometer fabrication process, it benchmarks really well and it doesn't throttle too much either. Well, we do have a few theories and a few were also shared by Yogesh Brar on Twitter. First and foremost, the SD7 Plus Gen 2 is actually a very expensive chipset and considering the average selling price of phones have gone upwards to over 20,000 now, people are demanding a lot of premium features. So brands are now concentrating on giving you features like a better design, IP rating, wireless charging, and a curved display. And when they do all of this, they cannot really spend too much money on the SoC. Also, what we notice is that Qualcomm is pushing the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 with the OEMs. So we saw the Nothing Phone 2, the OnePlus 11R, the iQOO Neo 7 Pro, all of those come with the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1. And I have a theory that the naming was a bit of a problem as well, because despite being a 7 series chipset, it performs like an 8 series one. What are your theories? Let me know in the comments below. For more such interesting tech takes, subscribe to Track and Take English.